Bacterial vaginosis, often called BV, is a very common condition. It affects the vagina and can cause a variety of symptoms including unusual discharge, odor, and discomfort. Many women may not even realize they have it because sometimes it doesn't cause any symptoms at all. BV is not a sexually transmitted infection, or STI. This means you can get BV without having sexual contact. However, sexual activity can sometimes trigger or worsen the condition. It happens when the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina is disrupted. Normally, good bacteria keep the bad bacteria in check. When this balance is disturbed, the bad bacteria can multiply. This imbalance allows certain bacteria to overgrow, leading to an unhealthy vaginal environment. Factors like douching, new or multiple sexual partners, and even hormonal changes can contribute to this imbalance. BV is more common in women of childbearing age, but women of any age can be affected. It's important to note that BV can increase the risk of other health issues, such as pelvic inflammatory disease and complications during pregnancy. It's important to remember that BV is treatable. There are various treatment options available, including antibiotics that can help restore the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina. Early diagnosis and treatment can help prevent complications. If left untreated, BV can lead to more serious health problems, so it's crucial to seek medical advice if you suspect you have it. If you have any concerns about BV, talk to your doctor. They can perform tests to diagnose the condition and recommend the best course of treatment for you. They can provide accurate information and guidance. Remember, maintaining good vaginal health is important for your overall well-being. The exact cause of BV is not fully understood. BV, or bacterial vaginosis, is a common vaginal infection caused by an imbalance of bacteria in the vagina. While the precise mechanisms are still being studied, it is known that a healthy vagina has a balance of good and bad bacteria. When this balance is disrupted, it can lead to BV. However, several factors can increase a woman's risk. These include lifestyle choices and certain behaviors that can affect the vaginal environment. Douching, which disrupts the natural balance of bacteria in the vagina. This practice can wash away the good bacteria that help keep the vagina healthy, making it easier for harmful bacteria to grow. Smoking, as it can alter the vaginal environment and make it more susceptible to BV. The chemicals in cigarettes can affect the immune system and the natural bacterial balance. Having new or multiple sexual partners can upset the vaginal flora, though BV is not considered an STI. Sexual activity can introduce new bacteria into the vagina, which can disrupt the existing balance. The use of certain soaps, bubble baths, and feminine hygiene products can irritate the vagina and alter its pH, increasing the risk of BV. These products can be harsh and disrupt the natural acidity of the vagina. It's important to note that BV is not contagious. It cannot be passed from one person to another through casual contact. You cannot get it from toilet seats, swimming pools, or sharing towels. Understanding these factors can help in managing and preventing BV. Many women with BV experience no symptoms at all. When symptoms do occur, the most common is an unusual vaginal discharge. This discharge is often described as thin and watery, grayish-white or yellowish in color, and having a strong fishy odor, especially after sex. Other possible symptoms of BV include vaginal itching, burning during urination, and redness or swelling around the vaginal opening. However, these symptoms can also be signs of other conditions. It's important to see a doctor for an accurate diagnosis. Section 4. Diagnosing BV Tests and Procedures Diagnosing BV typically involves medical history. Your doctor will ask about your symptoms, medical history, and sexual activity. Pelvic exam. The doctor will examine your vagina and cervix for signs of inflammation or discharge. Laboratory tests. A sample of your vaginal fluid may be examined under a microscope to look for clues of BV. These tests help rule out other infections, such as yeast infections or STIs, which can have similar symptoms. Section 5. Treatment Options for Bacterial Vaginosis BV is usually treated with antibiotics. These are available as oral medications, pills taken by mouth, vaginal creams or gels, applied directly to the vagina, it's important to complete the full course of antibiotics as prescribed, even if your symptoms improve. This helps prevent the infection from returning. Section 6, Potential Complications of Untreated BV 
While BV is usually not serious, it can lead to complications if left untreated. These include increased risk of STIs, BV can make it easier to contract infections like chlamydia, gonorrhea, and HIV. This is because the imbalance in vaginal bacteria can weaken the natural defenses of the body, making it more susceptible to these infections. Pelvic inflammatory disease, or PID, PID is an infection of the reproductive organs that can cause pain, infertility, and other serious health problems. If left untreated, PID can lead to chronic pelvic pain and increase the risk of ectopic pregnancy, where a fertilized egg implants outside the uterus. Pregnancy complications. BV during pregnancy has been linked to premature birth and low birth weight. This is because the infection can cause inflammation and other changes in the reproductive tract, which can affect the development and health of the baby. It's crucial to seek treatment for BV to prevent these complications. Early diagnosis and appropriate treatment can help manage the symptoms and reduce the risk of these serious health issues. Always consult with a healthcare provider if you suspect you have BV or are experiencing any unusual symptoms.